The first thing to do is leave the car in the same position that they were in until the police tells you to move it. Obviously, if you're in immediate peril, you could move the car. But if you're not in any immediate danger, you should leave the car in the same position as when the wreck occurred. That will help the police investigate the incident and make accurate findings. Also, you can use your cell phone to take pictures of any skid marks, uh, any obstructions that were in the road, or anything else that caused the accident. One of the biggest mistakes we see people make after being in an accident is to try to refuse medical treatment or not go to the doctor for several days. Getting an x-ray or other diagnostic tests, even if you think you're fine after an accident, will give you the peace of mind to rule out that you were injured. When you go to the emergency room, the doctor's gonna ask you if you've lost consciousness. Many people feel dazed after the incident. You've gotta make sure that that doctor records that. That could be a sign of a soft tissue injury, or it could be a sign of a mild or moderate closed head injury. One of the biggest mistakes we see people make after an accident is assuming people are gonna be honest about the way the accident occurred or assuming that the 30 bystanders that were there are gonna come forward and give their name and volunteer their information. That's why it's important whenever you're at the accident scene to document whatever you can, to make sure you make a record because you can't really trust anyone else to do that. Also, we see people who make statements to their insurance companies, who believe that their insurance companies actually have their best interest at heart. You should not call the first person you see on TV or the first person you thought you saw on TV last. You should investigate the lawyer that you hire. You should interview the lawyer that you hire. And you should make sure that you're comfortable with the lawyer that you hire. That lawyer is gonna be with you and with your case for the next several months and maybe longer depending on how serious your injuries are. Car accidents are serious injuries. And when you're seriously injured, you need a serious attorney. Call us today or visit us at msverdict.com.